Hey guys, how are you doing? In this episode, we are going to see about iOS 17.4 fast battery drain problem and some fixes I like to suggest to you based on my usage and observation and after collecting feedback from users who have updated immediately and used it for a week and little more and I'm going to share some troubleshooting stuff that will definitely help you to see some improvements. Alright, for the past one week, I have noticed that after updating to iOS 17.4, in terms of battery performance, it is a little bit bad. The compa to the previous iOS 17.3 and 17.3.1 which has also got many positive reviews from users since the release of iOS 17 which is a nightmare for overall bugs and especially with the battery drain problem. So based on the feedback collected from each iPhone model specific you know feedback from the users suggestions I have noticed that one problem is affecting many users after updating to the iOS 17.4 that is the screen off time or the idle time is quite high compared to the previous update and apps like Google Drive, WhatsApp and Instagram are consuming more than usual amount of screen off time usage that is in the background these apps are still using some system resources and services even though the settings general background app refresh feature is set to off. So in my case for the first three days I have observed that the background app refresh was on initially and WhatsApp was using quite high amount of battery power you know as you can see that this is the screenshot of the first day usage and here 1 hour 11 minutes WhatsApp was running on the background. So I'm not sure like it was not for any audio call or video call and the screen is not minimized and I was still using the WhatsApp. For some reason after updating to the iOS 17.4 only I started to notice this problem because this issue was not there previously and even though the background app refresh is on I haven't seen more than an hour of screen of time usage most of the days and in the second day you can see again the screen of time the idle background app usage was 1 hour 2 minutes and the next day you can see it is 1 hour 51 minutes and the next day you can see 2 hour 20 minutes. WhatsApp and all other app have contributed with the background app usage so it is not a specific bug that is causing the problem something related to the WhatsApp messenger I suspect that this is a bug with with the iOS 17.4 which Apple needs to fix as soon as possible. I have read about Apple already started working on iOS 17.4.1 and I have also submitted a product feedback uh, with the Apple official website that the iOS 17.4 background app usage is quite high than earlier. I'm expecting a fix is coming soon for our iPhone especially to address this issue. Even though the background app refresh is on, I'm still seeing some high number of you know minutes usage and sometimes it's even in hours with the application's background processing. Normally when we minimize the app and uh, not two minutes or three minutes usage is absolutely normal so even for eight minutes depending on how many times I open and close the whatsapp it is absolutely fine overall the screen off time should be within one hour in my case because I have done some optimization with the location services that I have suggested to all our users in our battery health maintaining tips video so if you are also experiencing fast battery drain after updating to iOS 17.4 do check the screen of time usage overall and make sure that the background app refresh is turned off right now. If WhatsApp asks you to turn, turn on the background app refresh, you can select not now, you can do it later. It won't affect the notifications that you normally receive from the WhatsApp messenger. Only if you send location and if you want to minimize the WhatsApp application for real-time location tracking at that time, the background app refresh feature need to be turned on. Other than that, it shouldn't be a problem with any application. And the next important thing related to the fast battery drain is when you navigate to settings and mobile servers uh, I have previously set it to 5G auto due to some network issues I was getting one or two signal bars in my area even though the tower is nearby so the 5G auto automatically switches whenever the signal coverage is poor to the LTE and then it will switch back to the 5G during that time of course when whenever you are in a place where the network signal coverage is poor then the battery consumption will be higher so to avoid that make sure you are switching to LTE mode and using it in areas one if you're seeing 5G signal strength is very poor like one bar or two bar then it is advisable to switch it to LTE 
otherwise if you are in an area where the 5g signal coverage is good then you can set it to 5g auto or 5g on according to your needs so do try this and if there is any further update related to the fix for uh, ios 17.4 fast battery drain problem i'll update it in our social media feeds thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day